guys, today's video is not going to be a typical vlog. I wanted to film a very quick and simple meal prep video for you guys. I usually don't meal prep at all because I have access to my kitchen pretty much all day. But I really want to start meal prepping so I can make sure I stay on track. Since I'm on prep, I really want to make sure that I'm doing things right since I'm really not seeing any progress right now. So I am going to start meal prepping. I don't meal prep in bulk because I don't like eating the same things every single day. So I'm going to basically just prep my meals the day before and just keep changing it up. So let me know if you guys like this video and if you guys want to see something like this once a week. I'll be more than glad to show you guys different kinds of meals that you guys can make that are very quick, easy, and taste good whether you eat them cold or reheated. The first thing you need when you want meal prep is Tupperware. I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and I picked up this set. It has 24 pieces in it and I actually really like them. It comes with all of these. The containers are designed with four easy to open and lock latches that work together with a silicone seal to keep foods fresh and prevent liquids from leaking. I only paid $17 for this, so this is a really good buy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys after. Easiest thing for me to eat right now is two rice cakes for pre-workout. All you need for this simple and easy recipe is two packets of your favorite instant oatmeal, some liquid egg whites, a stevia of your choice, and cinnamon. First step is to cook your oatmeal. So you want to add water. I added a cup and a half and I cooked it in the microwave for two minutes. After you remove the oatmeal from the microwave, you want to stir it and then add your liquid egg whites and put it back in the microwave for another minute. You can reheat it in the morning or eat it cold. I like to add sugar-free syrup to mine and it's delicious. For a mid-morning snack, I decided to show you guys how to make protein pancakes. All you need is a protein pancake mix of choice. I am using this Whisk Original Mix. You need quarter of a banana and some mini chocolate chips. I'm mixing one serving of this protein mix with a cup of water. And all you do is add mini chocolate chips and your banana and you mix it in. Cook it for two minutes on each side, but make sure that you cover it in between so it can get fully cooked on the inside. These taste great cold, or you can reheat them too. I like to use peanut butter as a topping and sugar-free syrup. This is probably the easiest lunch that you can make. It is cheap and it's delicious. I'm using the Uncle Ben Ready Rice and Chicken flavor and I'm just using some plain pinto beans. You can add hot sauce or any uh, condiments of choice. This next snack is again very simple and easy to make. All you need is tuna, avocado, some cherry tomatoes, and I'm using whipped cream cheese. You can also use cottage cheese or plain Greek yogurt. I just didn't have any at the moment. So all you do is just mix it in a container and cover it and put it in the fridge. This is amazing cold and it's also really, really good if you have it with rice cakes or any crackers of choice. This is a very simple snack that you can easily keep in your office or carry around in your purse just in case you get hungry. Cut the apple in little pieces and I just put it in a container and I'm also having this protein infused water. The only meal that I did not prep in advance is my dinner. I usually am home for dinner so I prefer to just make food right there instead of having it in the fridge. But you guys are more than welcome to try this recipe and keep it in the fridge and just reheat it for the next day. It's really, really easy to stay on track if you meal prep. I know for me, I tend to kinda snack here and there, but if I have all my meals in the fridge, then I know that's what I need to eat. And it just keeps things simple and it keeps me on track. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to let me know in the comments below if you wanna see a video like this once a week on my channel. Again, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like button if you thought this video was helpful and I will see you guys next time.